Welcome back to the channel, and today I wanted to jump into the Godzilla universe, taking a look specifically at why Godzilla hates King Ghidorah. We are due to be getting Godzilla facing off against the giant, three-headed dragon in the upcoming Godzilla King of the Monsters. But also, in Kong Skull Island, we were introduced to a history of the two titans battling it out, and it would seem their rivalry dates back long before civilization really began. So, why does Godzilla hate King Ghidorah? It's perhaps a bit of a stretch to say that they hate one another, in this universe at the very least, but in the Showa era, they definitely did. So there is a likelihood that they will carry it over to the legendary Monsterverse. In the Showa era, King Ghidorah is said to be a giant, evil kaiju from space. One that travels from planet to planet and just goes around wiping out all life on planets he comes across. Hence the term Planet Eater in the upcoming Godzilla anime. It isn't specifically explained why he actually does this, as he has been controlled in the past, but either way, Ghidorah comes to Earth, tries to wipe it out, and Godzilla, being the protector, faces off against him. They are quite literally opposites. They represent good and evil, yin and yang. In the new Monsterverse, we have already seen an age-old battle between the two titans, as seen in Kong Skull Island and the viral marketing released by Monarch. We know that King Ghidorah in this universe is dubbed Monster Zero, which could indicate a few things, Ghidorah being the oldest, a reference to a prime movie, or his alien origins, or him being the biggest. Either way, something happened between him and Godzilla that led to battle humans watching and depicting it on the walls of caves. In the Monsterverse, we know that Ghidorah is so powerful that his wings cause electrical storms just from moving, and planet-wide devastation is a result, apparently. Due to this, it would seem that King Ghidorah wasn't actually at full power when he and Godzilla faced off. Otherwise, the humans would likely have been wiped out entirely and would not have been able to go back and paint the battle. So this tells us that it is quite likely that King Ghidorah is indeed alien, otherwise what's the explanation for him at a lower power level? If he came to Earth in say a meteor or something, the impact and entry into the atmosphere would have rendered him weak. So why would Godzilla hate him? Well, we need to take a look back at Godzilla 2014. Godzilla in that movie was intent on destroying the Mutos but ignored humans. In the original Japanese Godzilla movies, Godzilla is and always was and has been a good guy, essentially, anyway. So the Monsterverse is highly likely taking a leaf out of that book. Godzilla is shown to be a protector, more so in the marketing than he was in the 2014 movie, but Godzilla and King Ghidorah are the yin and yang of this universe. Godzilla will not see any harm done to humans. He is the alpha predator, the apex monster on the planet. Any monster that challenges that title, whether it be from killing innocent humans or other kaiju, Godzilla recognises that as a threat to his dominance. It's not to say that in this universe Godzilla is actually the good guy that we know from the previous movies, but it's likely that he functions as any animal does, leaves things alone that really are no threat or food, and only bothers himself with food or threats. So humans would see this as something godlike, something worth bowing down to. They would consider him their protector, a god monster. So in short, Godzilla hates King Ghidorah because he is a genuine threat to his dominance. He could kill Godzilla, and like any predator, he needs to be the dominant one. Humans are the sideline, they just view, like ants among humans. But of course, that is just my theory. That wraps it up here for me today though guys, but please do leave all your thoughts down below in the comment section, and give me your theories on why Godzilla hates King Ghidorah in the Monsterverse. If you are new here, then please do hit that subscribe button, stay up to date on all the world of pop culture and movie news, and if you enjoyed this video, then please don't forget to hit that like button and give it a share. As always, it's been a pleasure, I've been Mr. H, take care.